Hi everyone, I'm actually going to be speaking in English because we're recording all of the sessions and this is probably going to be one of the more co um, condensed talks. Uh, the other ones are going to be split between two, uh, two halls. All right, so as I said, I'm so excited to be here today. It's so amazing to see so many of you here. Uh, many of you I already know, uh, the rest uh, I'm uh, eager to meet, so please come up and say hello. Um, four years ago, in uh, the late 2017, I announced the Core C++ Meetup Group. I was, I was hoping that I'll find some people who are interested enough in C++ to come join me for monthly meetings at our Meetup. Um, and a year and a half later, in May 2019, we essentially uh, celebrated the, the most ambitious goal our meetup group had, and that was to have our own uh, C++ conference. So, and not just a regular conference, a full-blown full international C++ conference, a course C++ that was held here in 2019. And it was sold out uh, at least two weeks before the, the, the conference. It had record attendance. Uh, we had uh, multiple <coughs> top international C++ speakers, and it was a huge success. And Core C++ 2021, which you all uh, came here today, is the first face-to-face -face, uh, C++ conference uh, since uh, COVID-19 decided to, to join our world as well, and we're very excited. Now, before I go on, I want to say that um, <clears throat> Core C++, both the meetup and the conference, are driven by the C++ community. So it's organized, it's a nonprofit organized by volunteers from the Core C++ Meetup Group, from the Haifa C++ Meetup Group, who organizes monthly meetings in the Haifa area. Of course, we, uh, we are hosted by the Academic College of Tel Aviv and Yafo, who are graciously uh, offered to host us again this year. Um, we're always looking for speakers for our meetups. You don't need to wait for the yearly or bi-yearly conferences to come and speak at our meetups. And of course, we're very grateful for Hamako, the Israeli Society for Free and Open Source Software, for all their help and support. So you should check out their important work and go and check them out. Before I go on, I want to mention a few things about the COVID-19 safety. You're all aware that we took some extra COVID protect, uh, uh, precautions, and we want to make this a, a, a safe conference for everyone who's here. So I hope all of you have your green uh, 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 tags and your green passes. I will remind you that please keep your masks on while you're inside the house and uh, inside the building. So this is really important for us to have a safe conference for all of us and also for all of our D1s at home. Um, if you don't have a mask or your mask gets uh, uh, lost or something, the reception has extra masks. You can go over and ask for another one. I will remind you that we won't have the rapid testing um, station outside the building tomorrow. tomorrow. So if you, ha if you don't have your green pass and you don't have today's test, you'll have to get another test uh, by yourself independently. Um, I will appreciate if you keep all your green passes for tomorrow. Uh, because we will check, otherwise we'll have to check the names that you got the test today. Um, so green passes are validated the entrance to the college, they're not even just to the building. So if you got here, I assume that you already passed that. Right, so we have a conference full of amazing content, and I'll just give you a little bit of the, the logistics. We have two halls. We're currently in the, hall, the economics hall. Uh, that's, uh, sorry, I'm looking at the wrong slide. Um, so we have a great schedule, and you can find the schedule at this URL. There's also printed schedules on the, t the reception table, and maybe you have them in your bags already. Um, I will remind you that the talks, all the talks are recorded, so you, even if you, cho you wanted to watch two, two talks, you can catch the other one on YouTube uh, after they'll be professionally edited and uplo update, uh, uploaded online. Um, I will tell you something, that the, CP the C++ community is very, very friendly. At least that's, my ex that's been my experience for the last five or six years. And I do encourage you to ignore your typical engineer 
uh, uh, instinct to go and talk only to your friends and actually try to reach out to somebody else, try to talk at least to at least three or four other people you haven't met before and just meet the community because we have so much to teach each other and most of the people are really uh, fun and great. Um, of course, if you have any issues with the conference, it took a lot of work to organize, but still you can look for our volunteers. They're wearing the turquoise shirts. Maybe Amir, you can uh, see one here. And the one is there. And we have uh, a whole bunch of really nice young volunteers who are helping us organize. So for any problem, reach out to a volunteer. If they don't know, they know they'll know who to talk to. Right. So um, the, f the conference is spread over two halls. Um, this is the very schematic map of the building. We're in the economics hall. The other half of the, the talks will take place in the Western building. So make sure you, you prepare enough time. In the, that's why we have the coffee breaks, so you have enough time to go between the buildings. Um, I'd like to thank GM, our diamond sponsor. Uh, they're one of the first sponsors to support us right when we announced the, the conference. Um, they trusted us with the organization of the conference despite all the COVID-19 uncertainties. So please go check out their booth and in our expo and be sure to thank them for their support because our community, as I said, this is uh, community driven, volunteer driven. We won't be able to uh, create such events without our sponsors. Our gold sponsors, they believed in us and believed in our vision. Some of them are uh, uh, this is the second time, and some of them have sponsored our, uh, our meetups. Again, we're a product of the community, and without our sponsors, we, we can't give you everything we want. So we're very grateful. We're also part of a very large community of, uh, of C++ developers in the world. And our communities support each other. Not just, it's not just about sponsorship or financial sponsorships. It's also about exchanging of ideas, mutual support for the communities, uh, encouragement, uh, advice for, uh, for example, for how to run communities, how to reach out. And of course, we have podcasts and websites, so go and check out these other conferences and websites. They're really amazing and very, very helpful for us. Um, our generous sponsors supported us. Uh, our, we have a community outreach program. So the program made our conference accessible to over 20 open source contributors, students, soldiers, and the conference volunteers. So we know m many C++ developers are very senior developers who come from very, with companies with um, very deep pockets, but still we want to make this uh, a very large and inclusive uh, community. And that, that's why it's important for us to make sure everyone feels included, and that includes uh, some uh, uh, community outreach program. And on this uh, aspect, we, I want to emphasize we, that we're adhering to the Berlin Code of Conduct. So that means you can go to the, uh, see the full Code of Conduct at the bottom of our web, web page um, to read. It. But I think there is one uh, quote from there that really sums it up. We're committed to providing friendly, safe, and welcoming environment for all, regardless of gender, sexual orientation, ability, ethnicity, socioeconomic status, and religion. And in other words, it means be nice, okay? Don't be, uh, just be nice to other people. Everybody is here to learn. Everybody here uh, has something to teach you. And everybody is here really to have a good time. It's not just a day off work. It's really an opportunity for self-development for all of us. So be nice. Um, we have a, a, a nice expo. Most of you have seen it, uh, just at where the coffee is. Uh, our sponsors are very eager to meet you all. They have some really nice uh, uh, goodies to give out. And I urge you to, to go and check them out because they have a lot of challenges and are actively seeking experts like you. So if you found it important enough to come and visit our conference, then you are exactly the type of people that our, our expo presenters are looking for. I will remind you that tonight we have the Core C++ meetup, and it's going to be a special meetup. It will be held here in the same venue. Uh, it's, it's going to start at 5.30. There will be refreshments uh, before. And it's open to everyone. So even if you have colleagues and friends who are not here during the day, you can uh, uh, suggest that uh, they come and visit us there. We're going to have a special meetup of lightning talks. So it will be a whole series of, of short talks 
Uh, some of them spontaneous, some of them funny, uh, just five to 10 minutes. At the beginning, there'll be a very, very special talk from a very, very special person. Um, you'll have to come and see it. Uh, I don't think there's ever been such a talk at a C++ conference before. Um, so we're still looking and still accepting uh, lightning talks. Um, so check your emails where we send the link or come to me or to Iran. We'll give you the link where you can register. It's only a five minute talk. So if you had a bug last week, come and tell, about, tell us about it. If you learned something new, if there's a nice library, a nice feature, funny thing that happened to you, it can't be that bad to give a five minute talk. It's a great experience and I really recommend everyone uh, to submit. It's a great way to start speaking at conferences. Right, so my last slide. I wanna thank my program committee partners. I wanna thank Michael, who's probably still at the reception desk. Uh, he's my awesome meetup co-organizer since our, our second, our first meetup. He's been invaluable in organizing everything from the schedules, our lunch, and also taking care of the mailing lists. Eran from Haifa C++ uh, meetup organizer. He, he shares our vision for the C++ community, and he's also orchestrating all of our lightning stocks for, for tonight's meetup. Uh, Amir, I don't see him, he just left. Uh, he's our man at the college, and he leads the, the, the student volunteer uh, band leader. Uh, he worked tirelessly to smooth hosting us here. It's, you can, as you can imagine, it's a very complex task to organize a, a, meeting, uh, a conference, especially these times. In Bal, she worked tirelessly on all the small details of the booths and all the bureaucracy. She worked again uh, with Hamakor, which helps us with all the financial and accounting parts. And we, I'm very grateful. And of course, a huge thank you to Yardena from the Academic College, who really managed over all of the production details, including all the COVID-19 safety regulations, which literally changed every day in the past three weeks, as you can imagine. Um, and that was a huge undertaking. A big thank you, of course, to all of the speakers, all of the student volunteers that who are helping us run the show, the production team, the video team, and most of all, thank you for taking the time to join us despite the COVID-19 and, and, and come and learn with us and share our, our love for the C++ community. Um, I wanna say that this, uh, this afternoon, we're really and truly honored to have our keynote uh, lecture by, uh, called Thriving in a Crowded and, Ch Challenge and Changing World, C++ 20, uh, 2006 to 2020, by Bjarne Straustrup, the, in the inventor of C++. He's going to be talking to us live, and we'll have a Q&A session with him after the talk. So uh, if you have questions, this is a unique opportunity. He's an extremely a pleasant and nice uh, person. He's so He loves to interact with the community and it's a really unique, unique opportunity. So if you have questions, prepare them ahead of time. We'll have a microphone that's going around or a microphone on a pole and you can approach and talk to him directly. So uh, we're so excited by this. Um, so let's have a fabulous uh, conference. Please stay safe, enjoy two days of, of fantastic content. And uh, don't forget submitting your lightning talks for the meetup tonight. Thank you.